Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Amazon Wayne here for another Sailor Moon review and unboxing. So today I have for you guys the Figure Zero Chouette Princess Serenity figure. So I got this very recently. I got it very quickly from the proxy service from Japan, which I paid an excessive amount for shipping, but got here very quickly. So let's go ahead and unbox it. I'll let you guys know what I think. So here we go. So let's open the Figure Zero Chouette Princess Serenity. So this comes in the original shipper. Uh, so yeah, so I got this from Japan, which is a proxy service. Um, their shipping is getting really expensive, so honestly, I don't know how many more times I'm going to be ordering from them, but it did come extremely quickly within a week. So here we have it. The Princess Serenity Chouette from Figure Zero. So the box is very, well, pretty plain. It's like a matte white with some gold lettering. The gold is not shiny, it's just matte as well. There is a window, but they have blocked the window with this little, uh, seems to be some kind of insert. So you cannot view the contents. The same thing on top. You have some other kind of insert as well, uh, and the color of the moon. So let's open it up, let's take a look. So here you have just like a piece of acetate, I guess, to uh, give it some color. So right away you can see her through uh, the plastic. So again, very large figure. Uh, she seems to be somewhat disconnected from the rest. So let's take it out. So as you can see, there is an insert. I don't know why they put this. You have to absolutely break the seal to be able to get this out, to be able to display her, which you will be able to do once you take that out. And they make sure you don't see her because you also have this piece of cardboard hiding it. But if you do, you can still kind of sort her. I guess you can sell this as new in box. I mean, again, the seal is broken. I don't know how many collectors will pay extra for a new in box if it's actually not new in box. So this is what you can do, the best case scenario, if you want to keep her without removing out of her package, and you can see her quite well in the box. I would love to remove her from her box, so let's go right ahead and remove her. So again, I'm very excited for this figure. Oh, so let's take a look. So here we have Princess Serenity. So you have a beautiful pearlescent finish all over her gown with some a clear undergown, uh, bare foot, uh, very shiny, nice, clear pieces. We've had clear pieces before, but not quite like this. You can see it's very yellow. Um, yeah, and it gets darker maybe a little further up. Same kind of pearlescent feel on the hair. And the ribbon flowing out in the back of her, just gorgeous. So let's put her all together and see what she looks like. So beautiful detailing as far as the back bow is concerned. Again, you have some transparency in the bottom as well, like the hair. Uh, so yeah, so she's just sitting on her moon. Uh, she's not actually connected to anything, which is kind of strange. I've never seen a figure quite like this before. You can see here, uh, it's just like one, um, uh, one little rod with two supports, and each one supports her hair. So you can see she's not fixed at all. She's completely off, and this is what's holding her hair. So basically, she's just sitting on this by herself, and you put her feet in the water. That's the only kind of groove or anything you have to put her in. I mean, you don't even need the stand, to be honest. I mean, the hair kind of holds on its own, but she does come with the stand to hold her hair. So that's up to you whether or not you want to put that. But again, that's what it comes with. And I believe that also this part, let's take her off. I believe that this also comes off, so you have the option of putting that on or not. Personally, I think it's gorgeous with it. I wouldn't take it off. So, there you go. And I would like to maybe one day put a light, an LED light under it, because that seems to be how it's supposed to go or how it could go. But for now, we are gonna rest her how she is supposed to go. It's a little tricky to get her in there. Okay. So her foot in the water, 
Her hair is, I'm gonna do air quotes, supported by these two <laughs> little rods. And there you have it. I mean, very lovely figure. I would definitely, definitely suggest it. Uh, again, I got it uh, from the proxy service from Japan. I paid a lot of money for the shipping, it was 4,700 yen, which comes out to about 65 Canadian dollars. So I don't know how many times I'll be ordering from them. But again, beautiful figure, very satisfied. I would definitely suggest her. So there you have it, guys. The Princess Serenity Figure Zero Chouette figure. Gorgeous figure, very well done. A little strange again that she's not fixed and has these little stems that hold her hair which don't really do much of anything. But besides that, gorgeous figure. I would definitely suggest it as I am a fan of the Figure Zero line. So please like this video and subscribe if you want to see more. I'll get back to you shortly with some more Sailor Moon reviews and unboxings. So thanks for watching and I'll see you soon. Peace out.